Uh, Friday night with the men, we played a former Heart of America conference foe, a Missouri, uh, Missouri Valley College. And uh, they, at one time, were ranked 25th in the nation this year in the NAI. And I, I expected a really tough fight. Um, we came out and probably played one of the best matches we played all year. Um, played very, very well in doubles. Um, came out strong and got off to a 3-0 lead. And normally, when you're playing a dual tennis match and you come out of doubles up 3-0, it's, it's a very tough hole to climb out of. So we put a lot of pressure on them from the get-go. Um, and then up and down the singles lineup, um, my goodness, it just, it just, we, we played so well up and up and down the, the line there. Very proud of our team. Um, what was, what was, what, what I saw that was very tough was 12 hours later, we had to turn around and play the defending conference champions in the Great Lakes Valley, which was Rockhurst. Um, they are an outstanding team, very good team, um, very deep, and they, 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 they got us on, on Saturday. We, we had a lot of trouble with them, I'm going to just be honest. They, they were a tough team. Um, but we, there were certain parts we played very well. We had an outstanding number three doubles match that could have gone either way. Um, our number three singles match went into three sets, so that, that match could have gone either way. And um, had, a, had a great performance from Brian Thomas at number two singles. Uh, he fought back in the first set and made things interesting in that match. And then um, our number six player, Jimmy Hunter, our freshman from Columbia, Missouri, had a three-set match as well. So, you know, that being said, there were there were there were some bright spots in, in that loss. You know, the 9-0 is somewhat deceiving because there were there were three or four close matches that could have gone our way. Um, so we're you know we we were a little bit bummed, but the great thing about it is we took very good notes in in those matches, and then we'll we'll keep a file on them to be you know and. Uh, we'll uh, work hard and retool and get back at them next year when it really counts, you know. And so um, we're looking forward to a great weekend of matches. We have a scrimmage on Wednesday against Johnson County. And then on Friday, we'll go down and play Drury. And then uh, we'll spend the night down there and then wake up and play Southwest Baptist on Saturday.